One of the things that really sets hospitals apart from the rest of healthcare is the fact that we not only take care of the patient, but we also make sure that we're taking care of the total needs of the patient's families. My husband, um, at age 37, was diagnosed with a very rare form of leukemia. I remember um, very vividly the first time that I heard the word hospice, and I can still think of the feelings that I had at the first um, thought of that word. Hospice at that time, to me, meant, you know, giving up, death, the end. I think we were all a little reluctant, not realizing how it was going to benefit us um, and how it really brought us through and how they just know, the counselors are just amazing just to know at each step. When we have a patient come on the program, we know that they have other support systems. They may have a family or a significant other. So we know that there are certain things that the family is going through. Our counseling is not a postcard or a letter that we send out, but it's making one-on-one -on -one counseling, group counseling, family counseling available. One of the things I know for sure is my family would not have been able to come through this without the counseling services at Treasure Coast Hospice. They've called me as, I mean, eight months later after mom passed away, however long it takes. Uh, they, they're there to counsel you, they're there for, during the grieving process. Both of my children were very fortunate to be able to go to Camp Good Grief. And it's for kids of the community that have suffered a loss and they're able to go for a weekend and just bond. We've had a camp for these kids who have lost a sibling, lost a parent, a grandparent, someone close to them. And with our grief counselors from Harbors are able to process that grief and it really does make a difference for them. It helped me like get away from all my anger and stuff. It kind of makes you feel less alienated because I feel like people are on a different level if they've gone through loss and grief and here everyone can relate to that. Being able to see some older kids that have gone through it that were then now counselors there um, that were had suffered a loss and are kind of guiding the little ones, letting them know, you know, it's gonna be okay, you're gonna be okay. 